Hola guys, welcome back to Fremlin's Workshop. If this is the first time joining us, my name is William. What we do is service and maintain small engines. So today we're going to be doing a handover video. We have three machines that we're going to be basically doing an introduction as to what we had done to them, test them, and then we will move on to the next, the other two machines that we have. So this is a brush cutter that came in for repairs and uh, servicing. It's a champion model CG430B. And uh, we basically serviced it with a brand new clutch. We replaced spark plug, carburetor went through servicing. We cleaned out the fuel tank from the gunk that was in it. We supplied and installed a brand new starter recoil. And we basically washed the engine as well. We tidied up the, the wiring loom here, as you can see. We cable tied them for neatness. And also we painted up the handlebars with this gray spray paint that we have. And if you come right down to the bottom where the spool is, there's a gearbox as well. So when you basically have them service with us, we, uh, we top up the, the oil in this gearbox or we top them up with, uh, with grease. Either one works well. Uh, we usually use oil, which, which in actual fact is better for the gears. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn the machine on and you guys are going to see um, how it runs for us this morning. So there you have it, another successful servicing. Let's move on to the next machine. Okay guys, we're on the second machine now. This is a Gentech uh, generator, four cycle. 7800E is the model and it's a petrol generator, four cycle meaning where it's got straight gas into it. So I'm gonna show you what all we had done to this as well. So we replaced the battery with the 15 AH compared to the old one here that we have. Um, we fabricated and modified this battery box to accommodate this brand new battery. As you can see for comparison, this one's bigger. We uh, changed out the engine oil. We replenished with uh, clean SAA30 oil. If you come around on the side here, we also uh, service the uh, carburetor it had a bit of gunk inside and a little bit of water in the fuel so we flushed out the carburetor serviced it did the same with the fuel tank where we removed the uh, contaminated uh, fuel and we added straight fuel again uh, we went through the air filter where we cleaned it and uh, it looked okay so we could have used it again which we did and we also replaced the uh, spark plug Whenever we replace spark plugs, we uh, usually go with NGK uh, because they, they give the durability to the machines in, in which where they last longer than the other spark plugs that we found out there. So we, we, we use that on our, all our customer machines. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to start it up and give you guys a little test run with the test light that we have here. And uh, let's see how this works out for us this morning.
So there you have it guys, another machine that's uh, ready to go. So let's move on to the next machine. Okay guys, we're on our third machine. And this is a Dewalt 3100 PSI petrol driven uh, water blaster. And uh, we basically went through the same as the other machines. So I'll just recap. We went through the air filter where we cleaned it out. We went through the fuel system where we serviced the carburetor. We went to the side where we serviced the carburetor. We changed the spark plug with NGK. Um, we drained out the engine oil and we uh, replenished that with clean, with, sorry, clean new oil. And uh, we topped up the uh, fuel tank after flushing that out with uh, clean fuel. And also, um, there is a O-ring that fits onto this gun here. So I'm going to show you this just for reference as well. There's an O-ring here um, that had a rip. That had, sorry, that had a tear. So that was leaking uh, water when you had this um, running. So we replaced that as well. So what I'm going to do now is turn on the water blaster. Give a little bit of a demo as to how it works out for us this morning. So make sure when, you, when you're running your water blaster, always have your gun pressed because you don't want, you don't want the, the, the water blaster to build pressure and then strain the pump. There you have it guys, uh, three machines. We came into Premium's workshop and basically we got the job done and we're happy to get it done. If you're looking to get similar of the sort done to your machine, if you, even if it's for residential or commercial clients, uh, contact us today on 9785-0370. My name is William and uh, we are located in Premium Street in Port St. Andrews where we have our workshop. So looking forward to hearing from you all. Thank you.